are going on day six for our herbs and day three for our lettuces. Let's jump in. So that's our parsley. Nothing yet. Cilantro. And it's so fun that I don't even have to tip over the basil. I can just show you. Look at it. Isn't it beautiful? That's our baby carrots. That's our dill. Green onions. And chives, I don't even have to tip that one either. It's so fun. One thing I forgot to mention in the setup is when you go to refill your tank, you can either take this top off if you want to, just be real careful that your pods don't spill out, or you can pull this guy up and fill it there. But remember, you want your water always to be between four and a half and five liters and you do have to replace the nutrients. So let's go ahead and check on lettuce. That's our freedom mix. So cool, day three, I don't even have to tip it over. It's just doing its thing, guys. This is gonna be our bib lettuce, same thing. I don't have to tip it over. On day three, my lettuces are sprouting. Isn't that amazing? Pretty sure when I did lettuce last year, I think it took two and a half to three weeks to get sprouts. This right here is gonna be the romaine. Still don't have my tomatoes. They still didn't send them to me. So here is gonna be baby spinach. The regular spinach. And then in there is our strawberry seeds. All right, guys. So, and then if we wanna go ahead and take a look, real quick look at the soil babies. Here's what's going on with the soil babies. They're growing strong. I've turned it off from the LED to the full spectrum because I have sprouts and so now we're in grow mode. We have one, two, three, four. So that's just kind of what I wanted to show you guys. Um, I'm still gonna go ahead and cover these up because they still do like the humidity. But thank you for checking in with me and take care.